Hello, we're here today to talk about maturity in customer relationship management systems, CRM maturity. Now, most people who implement a CRM system for their organization have a goal of the system providing them with information. They want to make informed decisions based on customer profiling, uh, customer activity, business development, growth in markets, whatever the goals of the business are. But in order to do that from a, a, a technology base that is a CRM, uh, uh, that from a technology base that supports your CRM culture, you need to have some best practice rules operating within the organization. You need to automate processes, you want a system to alert you to exceptions, things which are outside the norm of the way you like to operate. And if that's to be the case, then the, the data within the CRM system must be usable in a collaborative way. People need to trust the quality of the data before they can make informed decisions based on the best practice rules that you've defined. And if people are to trust the data and use it in a collaborative way, the data itself has to be accurate and timely. So CRM maturity can be defined in this stack. The base level thing that you need to do, the foundation of CRM maturity, is that the individual users of the system have to record their data accurately and timely. Changes in status need to be recorded at the time they happen, not some time later. If that happens, people can trust the data and collaboration becomes possible. And we can start to remove operational inefficiencies, like, for example, a marketing department that wants to invite customers and prospective customers to an event, but compiles a list in Excel and sends it around to account managers for ratification before they take a decision on which people will be mailed from the list. If we have accurate data at this foundation level first, that collaboration can be done without the need for the time-consuming ratification, and so on. Once people trust the data and will take decisions on it in this collaborative way, we're in a position where we can start to automate processes, we can let technology make things more efficient for us, and then get to the point where the system is genuinely providing us with a basis for informed decisions. CRM maturity can be a complex uh, subject, and maybe you'd like to know where you stand in, in this CRM maturity hierarchy by taking an assessment. There'll be a link at the bottom of this uh, YouTube video which will show you how to get there. And thank you for watching today.